those thousands if we ring up? Is it worth ringing up? What sort of money are you talking sure, about? Sure, okay. For the treatment of sort of um, hyperhidrosis, which um, is effectively sweating on their arms, and this devastates people. People get very depressed over it. People sort of, you know, don't leave their home for, for, yeah. for a long period of time. Um, it's 300 per arm, so that's not very much. And may I say that Ireland's one of the few countries now that is still treated cosmetically. The VHI should be covering this, and Bupi should be covering it. Britain, France, Germany, America, all treat it as a medical disorder. And um, the only alternative treatment is rather radical surgically, removing sort of, you know, um, the sympathetic ganglion. And we've seen recently some of the horrific consequences that, that can happen. Them. Okay, so again, you're not talking about taking out an extra mortgage. You're talking about prices that are within most people's pocket. Oh, absolutely. All right. What age would you start treatment there? Because I know some children have a problem with, 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 with body hair. Oh, sorry, for the treatment of body yeah, hair? Yeah. Um, it's very funny that you should ask that, Aidan, because somebody just phoned me up yesterday, but a child that was eight, and I sort of have to make a decision, you know, apparently. We have to work up sort of anybody at that age to see whether it's hormonal, idiopathic, whether it's polycystic, you know, ovarian syndrome on board. Yeah. And um, if the child has sort of hair at pre-pubertal levels, usually there's a pathological reason. It may be an, an andrenic tumour, it may be sort of um, of some sort of um, difficult consequence. So we normally would sort of run a child like that through a, a test, a blood test, or, or put them through an endocrinologist or a gynecologist in some cases prior to sort of being treated by a dermatologist. Okay, excellent stuff. We, we leave it at that. Thanks for dropping in this morning. Patrick Tracy there from the uh, Aylesbury Clinic. And Louise, thanks for telling us your story Thank this you. morning as well.